Hey everybody! Good evening. Whoa, camera way too high today. Oh boy! Whoop, whoop, whoop. It has been a minute, huh? There we go. I'm gonna need some throat spray. I'm a little, a little hoarse. Ah. And I'm gonna be doing it pretty, pretty, pretty easy on the mic. You don't want to whisper when you have a sore throat. Your uh, vocal folds rub together too much and it gets even more sore but speaking at a relaxed normal volume is uh is acceptable not speaking at all would be best but you know what i'm doing okay here we go i can't use this i gotta use the uh joy cons hold on a second oh boy it has been a minute oh. come on there it is Mario Galaxy requires both of the Joy-Cons. Man, I gotta grab the grip. Gosh, yeah, I haven't streamed since last weekend, so... I don't know, I guess I forgot. Which is weird. It's fine. It's fine. Technical difficulties are part of the fun of a stream, I've found. Personally, anyways, because it's like... It's something you otherwise... <laughs> ASL Let's Play. Well... I have seen people uh, make ASL versions of like YouTube videos, but at that point it's like, why not just do subtitles? I don't know. It's 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 neat, I think. But yeah, the the thing with uh with the stream is that you get to like see a more casual view of people. You get to see all the weird technical difficulty stuff and just kind of hang out. And they're like always, it's, it's someone always trying to entertain you, so they're always like trying to keep things going while still like doing something that is kind of awkward of fixing stuff technically. I don't know, it's weird. Streaming, you know? Alright, we're going to be doing a very casual playthrough of this. Um, I'm already a decent amount in, but I just want to be able to try and finish it as quick as possible. So I can get back to Pokemon. And it's not that I'm not enjoying this. And I will do 100% if someone greatly requests it. Although, it will take quite some time. Um, I just... I, I feel like I've been on the Mario games for quite a while now. Like, quite a, quite a good amount of my channel has been Mario. And I don't think it does super well, but I've still been enjoying it. So, I'm, I'm happy to do it for now. But... It'd also be nice to get, you know, some more viewers in here, maybe, you know, maybe a couple more viewers, I don't know. <laughs> it's it's very empty most times, but that's fine. I appreciate all of you that do show up. And I do my best to, uh, entertain. just put out a video recently that I'm super I'm super happy with I put a lot of work into it I've been working on it for like two three months uh, but that's up on my YouTube channel Iggy and the Ape you can find that link down below on the browser version I I'd appreciate it if you gave it give it a, a watch I put a lot of work into it as I already said and it's it's pretty good I think I don't know I like to think it is anyways I I, d I definitely took my time with it. God damn it. Sometimes which direction is forward it gets really twisted in this game. But I, I, that's part of its appeal or whatever, right? I know. Whoa. Oh, jeez. Come on, where do I go? Where do I... There we go. There we go. Whoa. Oh, boy. Uh, I was playing the Spyro remake, like, all day. And... Going from that to this is a very different feeling. Because uh, Spyro is much more horizontal, being that he's like a short little dragon guy, but he's like way faster. So it feels more like a car almost? Or something like that? Like it feels very different. This feels a little more human than uh, Spyro did. But I was enjoying Spyro a lot. The controls of the first one are not great, but. You know what? They're not terrible. And it's such a fun concept. 100%ing it is kind of a pain, but if I wasn't doing that, 
you know, it, it would be, it would be certainly more fun. Whoop. Whoop. There we go. Is Mario a human? Are we sure about that? Because, like, he went to the New Donk City, and those looked like humans to me. Those did not look like Mario. Man, what am I up to here? What am I doing? Wow. Oh, okay. It's just, like, classic Mario stuff. Uh, ooh, I could get those coins. Oh, I gotta go under, so actually I should have gotten those coins. Whoops. Up top. Nice, nice, nice. And back down. Whoop. Come on now. Come on now. Whoa. Oh, that's so many star bits. So many star bits. Oh, give me the last, the purple one. Aw, oh, dang it. Done. Doofed up. Yeah. Yeah, Rosalina from this game is canonically eight feet tall. So, who knows? And she's supposed to be from the pl the planet that Mario is from. Ooh, spoilers, I think? I mean, this game's been around for a long time. I can't remember if it's spoilers. I was watching Coco play it, so I don't know if it's obvious or not. I thought that Rosalina was like a twist villain for some reason. And that got uh, disproven pretty quickly by watching the end of this. Whoa, where'd the coin go? Oh, over here? That's, that's a lot farther than I expected. Hmm. Hmm. No. Oh. I see. Can I just get the... No, you can't get him with the deedly. <sighs> oh, well. Over here. Over here. Over to me. Bam. Got it. Come on, give me the last one. Give me the last one. Yeah. Oh, oh, I gotta do the... What? Yeah. Get him, get him, get him. Huh. I figured those were, uh... This is where I was supposed to go, but it looks like it was just a bonus? Maybe I gotta go underneath. Ooh, well, that's just a one-up. Eh. Waste not, want not, as they say. I want not. Whoa. Oh, right, that's what I was looking for. Okay. Disney poisoned my expectations. Oh yeah, they do do the twist villains all the time. On, on a, uh, in the Disney movies now, they're all like twist villains. It's kind of stupid. It stopped being a twist at that point because you expect it every time. Disapproval. Do not care for that. It's been fun sometimes though. But then when it's like in, uh. Big Hero 6? Also, where were they in Endgame, huh? They're part of the Marvel Universe? But, uh, in Big Hero 6, it's like you totally know that the only other dude they've introduced is the villain. Like, immediately, you're like, oh, what is he there for except to be a villain? <coughs> what are they doing? Hands is not too bad. Like, if you go back, it does make sense. It's just like, it's just underwhelming, you know? A comet. Speedy. Uh, yeah, sure. Let's do the comet.
Yeah. I wish Big Hero 6 was better. It's okay, but it's like kind of underwhelming. I don't know, the animation is much better than the actual, like, story and shit. You know? Oh, I'm timed. I'm th oh, right, this is... It's, it's, uh... Time trial. I'm glad this game doesn't have fall damage. And I'm not being sarcastic, that's actually very helpful. Especially in the case of this, it means I have so much more room to do stuff. Oh god, it's really hard to keep track of what direction is what, though. Fast Mario. It's fucking tractor vines. It's a good thing there's not really much, like, opposition to this. Like, I gotta do it quickly, but, like, I don't really have any enemies in the way or anything. It's a cookie. It's a big old cookie. Shit, shit, shit. Fuck, that can happen? Oh no. I've been playing this game incredibly safe, I realize. <coughs> uh, I do see that your chat comments there. I will be back with you in a minute. Uh, this is like, this is I uh, serious time, you know. I didn't, I didn't expect it, this to. Uh, I have so much focus. Shit. Mario Galaxy, I haven't been challenging yet. Not in a substantial way. The toads! The toads! Oh, I gotta go around the other side? Shit. Woo! Or did- oh, I didn't need to do that, did I? Oh no! Was this like a secret or something? Am I supposed to be here? Oh, okay, I need to free all the toads. Got it. His second Captain Toad. What a goof. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, I know this one. I, I saw Coco doing this one, I think. Unless, did I do this one? Shit. After I did all that? Please tell me there's a checkpoint. Try again, no! Oh, there is a checkpoint. Can I? No, there isn't, hold on. Okay, let me check the chat real quick. I never watched the Big Hero 6 TV show. I've been meaning to, it looks cute enough. But like, yeah, no, I just, there's so many other shows and things that already have my attention that like, going off to another one that I'm only kind of curious about right now seems, uh, yeah, seems like not something I want to necessarily spend my time on yet. I will watch it eventually. I just have to wait for a time when I've caught up on all the things I really am loving, you know? Come on, nope, Mario, this way, this way. There we go. Woo! Here we go. Here a uh, we go. As 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 he says. Wait, I gotta do the. I gotta hit the A. Shit, I can't see it.
Oh no, I can't see the thing I need to get onto. Hold on. Hold on. Do I need to do it off of here? There it is. Fuck. It was not letting me look up at it. What the fuck? That's what I had to do, and it wouldn't let me do it. That's bad camera, guys. That's just that... <laughs> that moment is objectively not a good camera, but that might have just been a weird glitch of the system. I think, yeah, I think it just freaked out for a second. Not great during a time trial, though. There we go. And there. Fuck off, spiders. I care not for your nonsense. It's just go time, you know? Okay, here's where I died before, so I just gotta be more careful. Okay, jump there, got it. Got it. Man, these blocks are scary. I don't know if they're gonna still be there when I jump on them. Whoa, whoa. Yep. Yep. I'm taking it very carefully. Because I do not want to fall again. I might be, like, out of time at this point. I'm taking it so slow. Whoa, it's like a donut thing. Okay. It's like orange slices. Please. Please just let me have it. No! Oh, why'd it go all the way over there? Oh, I don't have enough time. Oh god, I got 30 seconds to get back there. No! I can do it. I can do it. It's gonna be really tricky. Taking very careful. I think I'm almost there. Yes! Time to spare. That's how I do it. That's how I do it. Sometimes. I mean, most of the time I'm pretty bad. But there, I did it. It was a challenge run, so I did it. That's all I gotta say. <coughs> oh, save my game, yes. I did it. I have enough. Let's do it. Loma. Okay. <coughs> Boy, the difficulty since, uh... I guess this is only the second boss, but the difficulty since Mario 64 has really gone down. Oh my god, I got thwomped. I got thwomped so bad, guys. Holy shit. Hold on, I'm gonna have an Altoid. Give me, give me one second. I need some mint. <clears throat> that is, in fact, a, curi a curiously 
Strong mint. No, we flipping. Whoa! Oh shit! Oh god! Okay. I still did not fully caught on to what I was supposed to be doing there, so that threw me off pretty bad. God damn it! Not again! Oh, I'm an idiot. Hold on. I gotta set him off. Watch out for the fire flood. Uh, that works, I guess. I just gotta wait on that. Okay. I'm up. Gotta be careful not to hit the blue because then I will be down. It's gonna go with the coins. There we go. There we go. And then that goes up here. Whoa. Why is the mushroom standing up like that? That's confusing to my brain. Most of this fucking gravity shit is, though. Is this totally like the music from fucking the Bowser stages from fucking 64? This is like a recreation remix of those. That's cool. It does make it very scary. Whoa! There he is! Is Bowser. No. Oh god, I gotta go. It's falling apart. Oh god, I don't think it was worth it. How cool he jumps off the thing. Ah. Ooh. Ooh, made it. What's up now? Jeez. Oh no. Oh jeez. Oh my goodness. Oh my damn. Oh fuck. Hmm. Jesus, he jump away. Like, am I supposed to be doing something here or do I just wait it out? I don't know how I'm supposed to do anything about this. Is there like a trick I'm supposed to be doing? Do I have to hit him with star bits? Oh, 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 I had to trick him onto the fire. Now what, do I whack him? Get him. Yes, got him. Oh, he's twirling. I got him. Nice. Bowser. Oh, no. Oh, it's still going. Oh, he's got fire now. No, I had him jump on the thing, and now he has fire. Well, maybe I should get a little closer. Stupid. Can I get him? Good. He's hit. Can I get him on the other side? Boom. There we go. One more. What do you want? One more. One more. Oh man, this boss fight's fun. The boss fights in Mario Galaxy have been really fun. There 
he is. There he goes. <laughs> right on his back. <clears throat> nice. I got a star. Yes. I'm just feeling extra exuberant right now. I've been having a good day. I got a bunch of cards. I put most of them away because I need to get a display still, but... God. Hold on. Oh, they're still very new. They're still very new, so they're kind of slippery. Hold on. Okay. I got these. I really, I love these. Um, I see them in videos sometimes. These are Cherry Casino Tropical Teal. Tropicana Teal. Whoop. Like I said, they're still brand new, but they feel awesome. It's like, it's not USPCC like you get like bicycle or B cards. It's this specific like guy, this like team of like two guys, this like duo or something. Derek McKee and is distributed by Murphy's Magic Supplies. They're like 15 bucks a deck, so they're kind of expensive, but they feel so good. They have like this great, like lightweight feel to them, and they look pretty cool. I mean, just kind of like, you know, simple, but it's got like it's got like a nice sheen to it. It's like not super shiny, but it's like kind of metallic. I love them a lot, and I'm super happy. I've been meaning to get some for quite a while. Because they're supposed to be, like, amazing feeling. And the only other nice feeling deck I have is my Virtuoso Launch deck that is worth, like, $200. <laughs> um, well, okay, it's not. It's the, 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 the box is in bad shape, so it's probably worth, like, 150 If I tried to sell it on eBay, it's, it's, like, the rarest deck I have. And they do feel amazing to handle, though. So I'm always tempted to, like, grab them and just... Now... Not gonna do it, can't do it. Ah, Rosalina. You rescued another Grand Star. Empower has returned to another dome in the back of the observatory. Hmm, but I still don't think we have the star power. We need to fly the observatory through the universe. The villain who kidnapped your special one took her far from here to the center of the universe. Once our star power is restored, the observatory will be able to go there. Then you can reunite with your special one. Saving game, yes. Uh, what did you say? Two hundred to like one fifty. Yeah, it's um, basically it came out in like twenty twelve or something, like a long, a long time ago. Uh, and I I bought it when it was new, so it was like fifteen bucks for me. Um, and then I found out when I got back into, like, collecting playing cards recently that, yeah, it's, like, really rare now. And they're really sought after, so if you have a brand new, like, sealed box, it's, like, worth 200 bucks. But, because my box, I, I've used them, like, twice or something, and my box is open and is a little, little crinkled up on one of the corners... I probably would, wouldn't get as much, but I'm not going to sell them anyways, because it's just, it's cool to have something that rare in my collection, even if it was totally by chance. Um, if you want to see, like, I, I try and post on Twitter and stuff whenever I get new cards, and I'm going to make a video showing off all of the, uh, my card collection sometime soon, since I have the, the table back here set up, it'd be perfect for that. So, yeah, I, I'd say check those out. Follow, check out my Twitter for more pictures. Rare by chance is the best rare because it's always, um, as people point out, it's like uh, with like comic books. There was like giant size X Men number one or something. It was like X Men number zero, and they're just like the collectible issue, and everybody bought a billion of them, and now they're worth like nothing. They're the like most common fucking comic book ever because everybody bought them, so they printed a shitload. Shit. Okay. Um. I was tr seeing if I could drop into that. Uh. 
But y yeah, it's like the ones that actually become rare are the ones that nobody thinks are going to be rare because then they don't make enough of them. They, they don't make very many of them. And then that means that that makes them rare and a lot of them get thrown out because nobody expects them to be rare or valuable. So they just throw them away. But I got the rare thing. It is pretty fun. I've also been buying more stuff from, uh... From Art of Play, which is like limited run stuff. But it's pretty, pretty fun things. Those are the ones I put away. Um, like the the campy creatures deck I got recently. You can see that on my Twitter I posted in the last like week or so. It's pretty fun. That's true. I guess it does become like, I mean, people still collect it, but it's like, it's not worth very much, like, monetarily. You couldn't sell it for much because there's so many of them out there, but having them, that's a whole other thing, you know, with collecting. This penguin's freaking me out. Huh. Hello. So, star chunks, huh? The students are distracted by the sparklies. Ah, sparklies. Hmm, so do I gotta go get those? Oh, wait, wait. Ah, there we go. Hmm, underwater music. Oh, dang, really? So, like, most of the action comics... Action comic number one is missing a page? That's funny. Um, I don't care as much about action comics number one personally, but a number... a Spider-Man number one would be amazing. I don't collect comics in general, though. It's... It, it, there's just too much, and I'd want to read them all the time, and that would just, like, put them in bad condition, you know? Ugh, but they are kind of, they are, are nice. I do like comics quite a bit. I need to read more comics, man. I've been reading a lot of manga lately. I'm reading through Beastars, which is really, really good. And I'm super excited to see what they do with the show coming up. But I'm also like really far behind, so I don't like to talk about it too much because I don't want to run into any spoilers. Because it's, it's something you can spoil real easy. There's a lot of huge reveals. What, right, action, whatever it was. I don't know, man. Like I said, I'm not like a comics collector, so um, I forget. But yeah, I, I think it is Amazing Fantasy 15 or whatever. Whatever the first appearance of him is, first appearance of Doctor Strange, first appearance of uh, Ghost Rider, probably. That that whole, those three, those would be the ones. I already have like the fucking, oh, collectible three pack of all the spawn number one, like number one through five of spawn. Like I have that and I haven't opened it just cause I don't, I fucking, it's more interesting to me as a sealed object. And I can just read the comics probably like on Comixology or something? I don't know. All right, I gotta do that. Holy shit, I almost slammed right into that wiggler. That would have been bad. Oh god, this is taking me right by the fucking piranha plants. That's so spooky. Why would you do that? How am I supposed to get it? Oh man. Oh, okay. Oh no, it's timed. Oh jeez, oh no, I'm not gonna make it. Aw, oh, damn. Oh, first appearance of Witch Ghost Rider. Now that's actually a good question. I It would honestly be Johnny Blaze, because I don't know... Uh, the other ghostwriters as well. I mean, 
I'm a fucking casual when it comes to comics, so I know, like, the very big names, and that's about it, so... Yeah, probably Johnny Blaze. Uh, I know there's the, like, Blue Ghost Rider, that's pretty neat, and there's probably, like, a bunch of others. Um... I don't know, it is the one that was Sam Elliott in the movie, is that actually from the comics, or did they make that up for the movie? We did it, little guy. Danny Ketch, okay. Really? I didn't know that. Huh. Ah, Rosalina's library. I might go... I might go and, uh read the Rosalina's library book by the end of this series, but we'll we'll see. I'll, I'll probably, like, yeah, I'll do that after, like, the game's over and such. How many star bits you want, my little man? 600? A pittance. Whoops. Yeah, I mean, I like the I, I like the movie. I know a lot of people are like, oh, this is not very good, and it's like, yeah, there are better ones, but like, the Ghost Rider movie has the has that like that like feel and style of like the early X Men movies and stuff. The the movies that were like superhero movies before we had the MCU. You know, they had a very very different flavor to them. The Spawn movie I love, even though it's really awful. That kind of thing, you know? Just like the, the pre-MCU uh, superhero movies. That's like what I grew up with. Yes. Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? That's... Th th do they have Ghost Rider in Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? I, I only watched the first season of that, so I, I'm pretty far behind on it. Whoops, I think I needed that. Oops. ZL to dive. Whoa! Oh, that's helpful. That's actually very good to know. Ooh. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. What do I do? Oh, God, no. Please, I have a family. His name is Luigi. Someone please make sure to feed him. Last time I left, he got his hand stuck in a pickle jar and he couldn't eat for a week. The poor idiot. I love him the bitch, but he's a, he's a dunch. Hmm? Oh, red shell, red shell. I don't like all these beeping sounds. This is... Fucking harshing my everything. I hate it. I hate it. Get him out of here. God, that's so awful. What am I even trying to get? I, maybe I should have talked to the old guy. They implied that that would be important. But I gotta shred the gnar, dude. Whoop. Ah, shit. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to, like, throw those. Okay, I'll go talk to the old guy. Listen, I'm not being mean to Luigi. Luigi did this to himself. He could have gotten education, he could have gone out there in the world, but instead he decided to stay with his dear brother Mario. And you know what, it was the best thing that ever happened to him. Because Mario ain't never gonna give up on that boy. No sir. Not as long as he lives. Ever since those big eels showed up, we haven't caught any fit. Oh, so we have to get rid of the eels? That's what my goal has been? 
Shit, I've been totally fucking this up. Well, I need to figure out how to shoot the shell. So let's... Hold on. Oh, do you? Oh, jeez. Oh, God, I hate them. I hate those missiles. They make so much noise. Is it... I did it earlier. Is it Y? Yes, it's Y. But I missed. I got friggin' dunce. Okay, let me try this again. Let me try this. Ah! The red shell. Come on, come on. There we go. I got him. I got one. I got one. Oh, stop it. Stop it. Oh, boy. Where are we going? Come on, come on. Dead shot. No! Oh, that was right on top of him. Damn it. It was so close. I couldn't get it. Oh, hey, it's Captain Toad's Star Shroom. Rest in peace, Star Shroom. Rest in peace. Whoa. For a second, I was expecting him to fucking lift off the goddamn planet. Yes, got him. Oh, that's okay, that's okay. I can take a hit. Put me in, coach, I'm badass. Come on, come on, come on. Where is he? Where'd he go? Oh, did he zip away too fast? Where's he at? My query! I gotta take him out. There was a hit put on him, and it is what it is, alright, so we gotta do it. We gotta take him out. There's that son of a bitch! Little Mikey sends his regards. What? Shit. Little Mikey sends his regards. Little Mikey. Little Mikey! Oh. Come on now. Let me get one of the red ones. They're homing, right? This is go by Mario Kart rules. Oh, shit. Shit. Uh, little Mikey regards. Uh, yeah. Sends his regards. I got it. I got it. I did not see where the star went, though. That's not great. Is that it? Is that it? There it is. Ah, there we go. Did it. Another star in the bank. A new galaxy. How do I get up here? Yup. There we go. Yes, yes, yes. Mm. A bubble brace. Uh oh, is this the one where you gotta like 
You go like on the bubble and it goes opposite of where you're pushing. Oh, jeez. Oh, I don't like those. Okay. There we go. Right, I need a bubble. Ow. Why did I do that? Over there? Is that where I need to go? Yes. Hey, before you read any bubbles, let's sh sh be fill board. Uh, yep, hold down A. Uh, handheld mode, I could be tapping, but I can't do handheld mode and capture for all the lovely folks. Yeah, so, huh, can't do it. Got it, correct. Blow on it, and then correct yourself. Okay. This isn't too bad. Okay, it like centers it, so that's pretty good. Yeah, that's not too bad. Whoa, here we go. Whoa. Whoa. That's silly. Oh, well, there's a bunch of coins. I get all the coins. That's fun. That's nice. Uh oh, that spike is gonna pop my bubble. No, thank you. I can just wait. It comes back here, so. Come on to me, my pretty baby child. Thank you, thank you. Oh, boy. Oh, that's getting a little dicey. There we go. That wasn't too bad. I hear everybody complain about this, but it's like if you take if you take your time, it's not too bad. You definitely have to take your sweet time, though. So that's all right. Oh, that's a the launch star. There's more. Uh oh. Uh oh. Was this the introductory part? Was this the part where it's like really hard to lose because it's like trying to teach you safely? Uh oh. <laughs> Yep, looks like it. Oh boy, here's where it gets frustrating, isn't it? Okay. I'm in. Do -do -do -do. Oh. There we go. Here we go. Let me in. Although, one, I will totally agree with you. Luigi is the better Mario brother. I have a soft spot for Waluigi because he's the total underdog, but he's not a, even a brother of any of them. He's just a dude. Who, like, they pretty much literally say in some cases that he is just there to be a counterpoint to Luigi. Whoa, that's weird that I still have control of Mario inside the bubble like that. That freaks me out. We're through. Huh. Whoa. Uh oh. Didn't expect another one. Didn't expect two. Yeah, basically, like, isn't Waluigi, like, amazing at tennis? He's, like, in super great fucking shape. He can, like, fucking kick his leg over his own head. Which is supposed to be incredibly difficult in general, let alone for, like, an adult man. Adult men got tight tendons. They're very inflexible. 
but the, on average, you know, of course, there's like gymnasts and stuff, people who train specifically to be very flexible, and the martial artists, but this is very difficult to do. Uh, uh. There we go. That wasn't so bad. I died once right before the end. While Luigi was in a tennis game and Wario wasn't really, what won? That is, that's some juicy gossip. What if, uh, what was Waluigi wearing? Was he like, you know, clearly flirting with the other tennis, you know? Or was he, was this a cheating situation? Should we tell Wario? We might need to tell Wario. Okay. I'm realizing the more I play this that I don't really like it to be centered. I like it to be just off-center when I have it relaxed, you know? Feels better. I don't know. Ghostly Galaxy, I become Boo. Time to be a Boo. Spooky time. Sorry, I just... I put the cards down earlier and I just kind of... I've been practicing just kind of like keeping them raised up. I don't know if you guys can see this. No, it's just slightly out, but it's just like... It's just kind of like uh, set up in a specific way. It's hard to show because it'll still be way in the background even if I do scoot it over. Yes. Really? So Waluigi was there and w if he wasn't just there to be Wario's... Tennis double? That's interesting. Very interesting. I don't know, I feel like, you know, everybody wants Waluigi to get a game, but it's like... It's still kind of weird that Wario got a game, honestly. Like, he is just barely on the fringes of what I would consider gameable as far as the Mario series goes. What am I doing? Can you just do that? But you know what? That's just me. I do love the Wario games. Like, WarioWare Touched was the best DS game, but it was just too short was the only problem. I played the... the, the played that game to death. Hmm. Real talk, the sports games on the GBA were, like, the best sports games, though. Like, Mario Kart Super Circuit on the GBA? Best Mario Kart, hands down. Because you could dodge the blue shell. Like, it, if you if you drove perfectly, even the blue shell would just hover right behind you. And as soon as you make a mistake, it's going to get you. But if you drive absolutely perfectly, you won't get blue shelled. It's pretty wild. Oh. Is that what's happening? Hmm, right, right. I guess, I don't know. I, what would what would the Waluigi game be like, though? Like, what is War Waluigi's personality really? At the same time, though, that's probably what people said before they made Wario, uh, WarioWare, and then they played it and they're like, oh, he has, he can have a personality. He's a gross man, likes a lot of garlic. The key. How do I get the key? Hmm. There's gotta be a way for this, right? Oh, you got the key. There we go. What do I do? Oh, I gotta drag him through the thing, right? Through the sunlight? That's fucked up, but okay, it helped me. Huh. 
Yeah, I don't know. There was, um, BDG, Brian David Gilbert, did that video on Unraveling Waluigi, which I'd recommend. Anybody who doesn't watch Unravel, definitely go check it out. It's super fun. But he has, like, a, a video where he basically just breaks down who Waluigi is by the lore and, like, just kind of explain the character so that Nintendo has an idea of what to do with him. It's 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 hard to describe. It's a kind of high concept video, but it's very fun. So just look up Waluigi Unraveled. Oh, I should take a break after this level. I'm I'm a little past an hour now. Gotta get up, gotta stretch for a bit, you know. Mm -hmm. Come on, come on. There we go. Here we go. Take that. You think you can trick me? I see those cracks in the ceiling. I can. Ah, oh, that's right. You didn't trick me. You got to get up pretty early in the morning to trick me. Okay, you can get one up from coins still. Huh. Weird. <laughs> well. Well, even the ghost house isn't much of a mystery. Hmm. Hmm. Got him. Whoa. Oh, that's right. These are the grabby stars. Shit. I did not grabby correctly. Ooh, that was tricky. Um, I think the reason I like to have it slightly off kilter is because Mar usually I'm trying to get whatever's ahead of Mario. So having it perfectly centered just keeps it on him. That's not what I want. Mushroom. Secrets. Sneaky secrets. Yes. It's me. It's a me. Spooky o boo Man, I wish the boo shroom had come back. It kinda did they didn't really have much in the way of like um power ups in Mario Odyssey because you had the cap and that means that you could just be a bunch of different characters. Which is another idea they ripped from Banjo Tooie. What the frick? You know? Back off, back off. Let me out, let me out. Let me stop being ghost. Let me back to life! You didn't understand, Mario. This was a one way deal. There was no coming back. Mamma mia! Oh, I can't go through the grate? Oh, hey! It's Luigi. That's right, I gotta hit the fucking button. Oh god, Lu Luigi, you gotta stop. My boy, my sweet summer baby child. My delightful tuna tuna, you gotta, you gotta stop, my man. Oh, thanks for the Power Star, Luigi. Yeah. That was very helpful, my man. Is that what I was supposed to get? I'm gonna have to guess. 
Oh, Luigi, get out of here flipping in at the last second. You just hung out. I guess he gave me the star. Whatever. Welcome back. I can see your brother from here. If you ask him, I bet he'll help you search for power stars. And I'm sure he has a lot to tell you. You should go speak to him over there by the garage. Yes. Yeah, that's a good point. I mean, yeah, Toadette is the fucking... Like... Toadette is... Effectively what Waluigi is. She's just a reason to have a partner. Same with why they brought Daisy back so Peach could have a partner in Double Dash. Hey. You're looking... You're looking for Power Stars, right? Let me help. I think you might have missed one in the Good A Galaxy. If I find it, I'll write you a letter. Keep your eyes peeled for it. Mario... Mario! This is a screaming one. That's my favorite. In in Luigi's Mansion, most of the time he's just like, Mario, Mario, Mario. And then every now and then he just goes, Mario! Like at the top of his fucking lungs. It's adorable. I love, I love Luigi. And honestly, Luigi's Mansion... Solid game. Whole series, pretty solid. I'm glad people realized that, like, when they made, uh, Dark, Dark Moon. Let me up. Up beat. Hmm, I need two more. Oh, I was gonna take a break. I'm, g I'm gonna actually go do that. So, don't go anywhere, don't touch the internet dial, I'll be RB. Okay, okay.
All right. I've returned. Got a little hot water with honey. For my uh, voice, whoops. Left the door a little bit open. <clears throat> it's not like it matters that much. I just don't want like my cat pawing, trying to get his way in. Sometimes he'll like paw under the door, um, and you might you might see his tiny little hands down under there, trying to claw underneath. But if I leave that open, he'll probably try and creep in, and I'll just see the door opening, and I'll fucking lose my mind. <laughs> Is scary. I don't know. All right. I don't want to be up too late tonight, so I might only go till like 11 or so. Maybe. You know, I'll do what I used to do, which is I'm gonna go two hours, take a second break, and then I will find a good place to stop at somewhere around 11 30-ish. Maybe. I don't know. Well, I'm playing it by ear. Is basically what I'm saying. Oh, the Elgato's having a little bit of trouble. Hold on, I gotta see the... Okay, I talked to that guy. Got it, let me, real quick. Just gotta reset the Elgato, only takes a minute or so. Apologies. Here we go. There we go. It's back. How bad is the leg? Oh, not that. It's actually pretty good. There's all. Uh, there's always because I'm using an HD 60s Elgato. There's always a little bit of lag, which is unfortunate. You know, I I wish, I wish I could get rid of it. And apparently the way is just to get the HD 60s plus. But that means that I basically have to have this awkward way to sell this to make enough money for that because they're the same price, I guess. Um, but yeah, I'll have to figure it out at some point. Um, the thing is, I don't want to take time off from this, so I don't want to sell this and then buy the other one. Final swim test. Uh, yeah, sure. In this test, you must collect shells in the ocean. If you bring me the gold shell, it's an automatic A for you. Gotcha. Okay. So do I just go over here? Use ZL. So do I just go or... Oh, yeah. Oh, shit, they're all just... Oh, they're just swimming. That's cute. That's really cute. I like that a lot. Okay. I gotta get the gold shell, he said. Sure. So I gotta... Oh, there we go. Got it. Is that... That can't be it, can it? That's not... There's no way that's the end, is it? Is that all I needed to do? Is this going to turn into the Power Star? Amazing. I didn't think you'd actually be able to bring it back. Well then, here's a big gold medal for you. Oh yeah. Neat. Wow. That was incredibly easy. Nice job on the test, but... Are you even one of my students? This gold shell's still mine. Bow, take that. <laughs> I got him. Wait. Drink a hot drink. Got a cold drink. I don't think that's probably good for my teeth. Wasn't that a Foamy the Squirrel cartoon one time? Or like part of it? Like... Foamy was talking about how your teeth could explode if you, like, drank a hot drink and then a cold drink. Huh, maybe. Maybe that's in there. I don't know. I never watched much Foamy the Squirrel, so it's it's been a very long time and I didn't remember most of it. Bro, I got a star, but now I can't get back. This picture shows where I am. Help me! From Luigi. Mario. Um... Oh, where is that place? Let me give you this picture so you won't forget where Luigi is. Pause and go to the letter icon. Got it. Good on you, Toad. Toad of the mail. Mmm. Oh my goodness. I always forget how, like, effective honey water is. But it's like my voice was a little hoarse. Honey water? Bam. Feeling great. 
feeling so much better already. I haven't even drank very much of it. It's just a little bit... Basically, just make tea, but don't use the tea bag. Just the amount of honey you'd have in tea in some warm water. Stir it up really well. Absolutely amazing for your voice. Because I got, I got so many remedies and <laughs> shit, you know. I'm kind of a hypochondriac, and I'm very protective of my voice. Because it's my job. But, like, sometimes it's simple things. You don't need, like, some fancy spray. Just a little bit of syrup from the bees. A very spooky springs. A very spooky sprint. Yes, yes, yes. Here we go. Is this speedrun level? I can manage that. Yes. Oh, a green star shroom. Come on now. <clears throat> Excuse me. I did just have dinner before I started the stream, so I'm trying not to. Uh, not to, uh... I'm trying not to burp into the mic. I, I, just, I was trying to think of a pretentious, like, ooh, um, did not... did releasing the, the, the gas of the st and I was just like, ah, I can't think of anything. I'm trying not to belch. Alright, let's be honest. Let's be real. We're all human. We, c we can pretend like that is the case. Whoa. Oh, this is cool. No, no, the key. Ah, oh, damn it. I see what's happening now. <sighs> Come on now. Come on now. Okay, okay. It's weird. The floor does not move, but the it, it's just the uh, circle. Whoa. Oh, shit. I mean, it's basically just a moving platform with a different, like, look to it, but it's pretty neat. I like it, personally. Come on now, come on now. Please, please. There we go. Heck you, boo. Yeah, you live here now. I've decided. Is it gonna move? Oh, these ones don't move. Okay. That. Whoa, shit. God damn it. I expected it to move out. Well, this is why you get a lot of lives, you know? I keep forgetting the long jump is a thing here. The long jump makes me nervous, though, because I don't know if I'm going to be able to move back out of the long jump in time. Whoa, whoa, oh! Oh, I see. Okay, that took my brain a minute to, like, comprehend what was happening. So the floor is busted up, and then this is only showing a portion of the broken floor. That's, that's bananas, dude. Nintendo, man, good job, guys. That's very, very creative. Damn. Whoa, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. There we go. Oh. Just start... Oh. Larger bits. 
I just gotta focus on him. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh no, I gotta go. I gotta go faster. Ah! Ah! Where am I going next? I need more wall. Ooh, do, 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 do. And I gotta grab the coin. Or the key. Coin. What the fuck's wrong with me? And uh, yup. Yup. Jumping off. Let me up. Let me up. Oh, oh, one at a time. Oh, jeez. There it is. Whoo. My goodness. Okay. Oh, it was a hidden star. Huh. I thought that was Spooky Sprint. Neat. We have discovered an enemy base in the region. We can only hope they are not misusing the power of that poor Grand Star. All right. Mm. Let me see it. Bowser Jr.'s airship armada. Well, heck, if you put it like that, let's do it. This is going to be my second boss fight this stream. That's pretty good. <clears throat> Here we go. Heck you. Oh, he was further away than I expected. We got the left to right shifties, and we got the go wherever guys. These pink ones, they're the go wherever guys. Woo! Where are we heading, boys? Well, I presume right there. I guess this is a backup. I shall be your doom, Carmella. Kamek. Magic Koopa. He is gone. Is that it? I just need the one? Okay. Uh. There. That's where I want to be. Oh, hey, it's Captain Toad. Loomy, Luma Bop. Welcome to the Luma Shop. I don't have any star bits. What, what do you got going, Captain Toad? Mario, we finally made it. Oh, oh, oh. Give me those bits. Give me those boots. I need those. Man, killing enemies in this feels really rude because it's so easy that it's like... It, I don't know, it feels kind of cruel, almost. You know? Mandabug. 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 There we go. Three more. Three more I need. Please, please have some. Yes. Yes. Yes! Give me the lollipop. Give me the lollipop. Luma Lee, Luma Pop. Welcome to the Luma Shop. Which will it be? That one. Alright, now fill me up with exact change. Ooh, so fur. Now I'm feeling great. So here I go. Transform! 
You did it. Thanks, buddy. Thanks for the snack. It's not gonna matter if I fall off necessarily, but you know what? I'm gonna try not to do that if I can help it. Whoop. Oh no! No, no! No! Mario started drifting. Well, damn, there goes all my fucking, like, harder and star, but it's not worth it. I'm just gonna fall off. Damn it. Well, that sucks. Damn it. God damn it, Nintendo. You gave me a, a lemon of a Joy-Con and it fucking... It drifts. It drifts. What am I meant to do about it? What am I meant to do about it if it drifts? You know, there's like tricks you can do and like repair and oh, you can update. The... I don't. I don't have enough time, guys. I'm too busy. I got a lot to do. I gotta mess with cards and stuff. I gotta learn how to do a magic trick or two. Get the help. There we go. Let's get him. Oh, I see. I gotta actually aim it. Okay. Turned nothing too hard. About that. Get out of here, comic. Nobody likes you. I didn't forget to invite you to my bar mitzvah. You just weren't invited. Fuck. Hmm. You know, that's true. Um, that's the thing. Uh, I usually play with the... What is this? The PDP, like, face-off or something? Uh, controller for Switch. It's if you. Crap, how is it? Do you just like peel at it? I don't remember. Eh. Eh. But you can kind of. You can see it. The like front face of this, the red part, like comes off. I can't remember how. Does that do it? No, that just pulls off the back switches. Um. So it's technically customizable. I can't find any replacement faces. Oh no. Oh no, I put it on wrong. Ah. There we go. I usually use that, but it doesn't have motion control and it doesn't have rumble. Rumble I don't really care as much about um, motion control. For this game, you have to have motion control. So uh, unfortunately, it is a necessary evil in this case. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. Fuck. One thing I do like about it, aside from the programmable, like, paddle on the back, is that it has a headphone port. So you can listen, you can have it connected, and then instead of having to reach your headphones all around to the switch, you can just plug it into your controller. It's got a little bit of background noise, but not too much because it is, uh, it is a hard wire. And not just a, uh, and not like a Bluetooth or anything. And it's pretty good. Um, but the thing is, if the audio is going out to that, then the audio is not going out to the stream. So I can't use that on the stream. And in fact, uh, when I'm on stream, I am just listening to the output from OBS. So, like, I'm hearing the sound, uh, well after you guys. It was only like 25 bucks. Yeah, the, the headphone port is really useful if you're not like streaming or anything. Um, it feels great, you know? It feels kind of like an Xbox controller. Uh, yeah, pretty. it's it's pretty much modeled after an Xbox controller, uh, but not quite as chunky, and it definitely feels lighter. But it's uh, $25 at GameStop, probably less used, and it's like, it's such a dumb, it's like a piece of dumb technology, so they like, is probably fine used. There's not a lot that can break. 
I like I like that nowadays we do like it used to be back in the day like the third party controllers sucked. They were like gimmicky and they broke and they were like really just like crap. But nowadays, like modern third party controllers are actually pretty good. Um, I mean, I did play no rhythm games. Uh, yeah, I, I played a bit of the new Kingdom Hearts for the demo stream last week, and I had to just do it visually, and I did not do very well. I got, like, I think a B at best. Um, but, like, yeah, and, and that's just when I'm playing it on stream again. Like, there's no lag when I'm using the headphone port. It works fine. Oh yeah, I heard Mad Cats was okay, but Mad Cats was like pretty expensive back in the day, wasn't it? Like that was the the premium third-party controller. Like how you can get a kind of decent headset if you get Turtle Beach, but at that price you may as well just get a real microphone. And I I'm okay with things being Xbox 360 controllers because the Xbox controllers honestly feel the most comfortable. I didn't play them that much as a kid, but like like, I personally always prefer Nintendo as far as console goes. And PlayStation, I, I have some nostalgic memories of PlayStation, playing like the Pizza Hut demo discs and stuff. Um, some Spyro and things. But like, I never, I never really played Xbox until pretty recently. But Xbox controllers are like the best. They just feel really good. They got like a nice heft to them. They're like angled perfectly for your fingers. It just sucks, though, because they're basically, like, mirrored the buttons of the, uh, Nintendo. Fuck! So it's, I, I always mess them up. Were they cheap? I don't know. I never had a GameCube, either. Um, my little brothers had a GameCube. I, the most recent console I had for a long time was the PS2. And then I... Uh, when the Switch launched, I was like, okay, this has to be the first console I buy myself um, since the PS2. And I bought it new. I, the, the PS2, I bought uh, used at like a GameStop, but I was so proud because I bought it with my own money for like a hundred bucks. And I've got a lot of mileage out of that PS2. Mostly Kingdom Hearts. Um, pretty much, yeah. There were some other games. Uh, there was a spawn game on PS2 that was pretty fun. It, it got kind of tedious. It was like a beat em up. It's there's like a part where you like the, one of the later stages is like in Central Park with like all these uh, like treant characters, which is fun. But it is impossible to navigate. The like fucking everything looks exactly the same. So like I just got lost and I never finished it. I'm trying to focus this time because I don't want to have to do it a like, fourth time. It's not that hard to get here, but it's enough of an annoyance. Damn it, aiming these shells is a pain in the friggin' ass. Oh, come on, I turned. I turned. I turned there. There we go. No more. Nope. Yep, that got it. Hmm. Nope, that's not the win. That is uh second form. Got it. Second form from uh well I guess he's not a mini boss, he's a full boss. God damn it. Whoa, shit. Oh god, oh god, it's out of control. Oh my god. That's too much. Ah, and he broke the freaking shell. Fuck. This is very hard. Oh, that's an unfortunate one. Thanks for thanks for joining. 
I hope you have a good rest of your Saturday night and weekend. Hopefully, join us for uh, for tomorrow's stream at about the same time. I'm trying to stream on the weekends. I'm trying to go for Friday. Yesterday, I was just like exhausted, so I could not stream. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to do Friday, Saturday, Sunday, 8 p.m. At least a couple hours. I want to. I want to stream longer, but it's just, it's its really exhausting. I mean, it's like, it's fun, but it can be really exhausting. I want to play some Jackbox sometime. I, I played some uh, over this last week, and I forgot how much I freaking love Jackbox. It's so fun. Frank. Already lost a piece of life. Huh? Only in the very beginnings of the battle. It doesn't bode well for me, does it? But I think. I think that does it for the first part. There we go. That does it. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Whoa. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, there's another Koopa. Oh my god, there's two Magic Koopas now? This is too much. Ah! Oh my god, this is supposed to be like a thing kids can play? I can barely handle this as a full fledged adult who does like dexterity shit. I'm fairly good with my hands. Why can't they Mario? Fuck. Ah. Well, coin. Oh. The coin got exploded. Fuck, I missed. No. That's like my last chance for quite a while. It's really hard to get in there. Fuck! Why did I throw that at the other turtle? No, stop throwing it at the other turtles. Throw it at Bowser. Junior. <sighs> nope. Come on, come on. Come on. Oh my god. Please, is that enough? Yes. Oh my god. That was such a hard fight, dude. Oh my goodness. I did it. I did it. Let's get cracking on these next galaxies. Okay, that's four out of six, so yeah, I might be able to beat this this weekend, which would be good, because I'd want to get back to Pokemon. I've been enjoying Mario, and I'm happy to be doing this uh, since the game just came out, but like, I'm going to save 100%ing these for like another time. I, I got to get back to Pokemon. Soon. Soon, I say. The bedroom? Hmm. Thanks to you and your friends, all of the dooms on the lower level are working again. Once the engine room on the upper level has power, the whole observatory will be working. Then the comet observatory will fly as a starship once again. And you will be able to fly to your special one in the center of the universe. I would love to save my game. Thank you very much for, for asking. <clears throat> All right. Let's go. Let's see. Over here. 
the the bedroom. Yeah, there it is. It was by the fountain. Nice, nice. Twenty-four. Alright, I gotta get seven more. Ooh, Gusty Garden Galaxy. This one has gorgeous music. I already know that. I mean, the whole damn game has great music, so... Wait, no, I want... Hold on, that's... That's where I want it to be, I think. I don't know. <coughs> ah, bunnies in the wind. Bunnies in the wind. They're so entrancing. Bunnies in the wind. They feel like dancing now. Bunnies in the wind. With Fluffy Fluffy can shake or press Y to fly higher. Only up to three times, boy. Boy, boy, boy. Let's uh, collect some star bits real quick. A dose of Koopas. Get out of here. Get out of here. No one asked for yous. Freaks me out that it takes two hits. It doesn't feel right. You know? Feels like you should take them out in one. Mom said this looks like a hamburger bun. I'm gonna say it. Alright. Someone had to say it. I'm glad it was me. Boy, just kicking them when they're down feels real, real mean. Like, I get it. They've been harassing you for friggin' decades, Mario, but like... My goodness. Feels a little, little much. Whoops! Yeah, twist up higher, got it. Oh yeah, there's that music. Oh no, the pedals! Oh you run out of time, that's that sucks. Okay, I got it, I got it. So you only get so many of those for the loose. Oh, this is easy because I got the whole thing. Oh. And one more time. That should do it. Whoa. Uh. No. No, one more time. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, that was very close. Oh, dang, that, like, homed in on him. Oh, that was what I was supposed to do. Okay. Whoop. And, yeah. Nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's see. I think I'm probably gonna play... Yeah, I'm gonna play up until the, uh... Hmm, well, should I play the boss fight here tonight? Because that doesn't leave much for tomorrow. You know? And I want to I wanna have something to do on tomorrow's stream. I don't want to just blast through it. Maybe I'll do, like, some more Mario 35 or something. If I, if I, uh... Do that? I don't know. Huh. What am I supposed to do here? What am I... Is there something on the other side of this? Oh, there is. Okay. We gotta start bits them? Yes. Thank goodness. Oh my gosh, that beeping was... It was putting me at in. You know what I'm saying? Doing me editing, I don't even remember how it goes. I'm not, I'm not really of that persuasion, personally, but 
And I've known quite a few people who are, and I can do the voice all right. Hello there. <laughs> it's because my voice is a little hoarse right now. I, I can do it a little better. Because usually I'm like, hello there. Now I'm, I can actually give it a bit of a, oh, hello there. Don't try it. Oh, am I chasing him? Chasing Wabbit. The 3D Mario way. What am I supposed to do here? Oh, I got it. Long jump. Nope. Can't. I like this. It's like a puzzle box. Do I just gotta keep chasing him, or do I gotta, like, dive at him at some point? I feel like it looped here just now. Well, maybe not. Got him. Okay, okay, you got me. Here, take this star, boy. -oy. Boy, -oy 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 -oy. Don't expect to catch me so easily next time. Listen, pal, you said it, not me. I didn't even want to catch you. You put yourself in this predicament. Still need another star for that one. So let's let's see what's happening in Gusty Galaxy Garden. Gusty Garden in Galaxy. The dirty tricks of Major Burrows. Hmm. Take that, Goombas. It's actually less convenient to stun them because then they go further away. Was that it? Was that just... Was that just bonus stuff? Well, alright. I suppose. Come on, come on, come on. Give me that coin. Oh, another coin. Oh, another coin, eh? What are all these coins about? Hmm... Whoa, whoa, there's so many. Ah, ah. I'll just fall down due to gravity. Okay, so this is where I'm supposed to experiment with these guys. Gotcha. So I gotta knock them out and do the thing. That's easy. That's easy enough. Knock them out of the ground. Stomp him on the big ol' head. Ooh, I'm on the question mark. Oh, jeez. Ugh. It's a lot of looping. Alright. 
Come on now. Come on now. Come on now. Bam. Alright. Here we go. Off. Into the void. Oh, those are just straight up apples, dude. Straight up apples without apples. Ah, oh, dang it. I wanted to stop off on that point. Oh, well. I thought that's where I was going. Oh. Is that what's happening here? Okay. Knock him right out. Got it. Oh, am I choosing which direction he goes, though? Or is it always the same one? And he's a... This is apple is a little too... Too... Too shiny. Doesn't feel like a real apple, you know? There we go. Yeah, come on. Let me on. He's munching. Not me, though. How does a caterpillar have goofy buck teeth? How does he do this? Oh, nice. Oh, jeez. Whoa, just... Just almost grazed that thorn. Nice. Okay. That's a good loadout for what I presume is a mini boss. Uh Bunny, watch out you're being chased. No. No. Uh I don't like the fuzzier things. Now that they're upscaled, you can tell that it's just like it doesn't fall at all. It's just like prickly looking. I don't like it very much, to be quite frank. There we go. His ass. Whoa. Oh, he's angry. Oh, he's very angry. No, get him. Oh. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. He's kind of scary now, actually. Oh, frick. I gotta get the coins. No. Oh, they're gone. Fuck. Okay, I think I'm gonna call it after this. This mini boss, this feels like a better spot to stop it than right before the, uh. Right before the second to last boss, you know? Whoops. Let's go, go, go. And there we go. Oh boy, here we go. This one's pretty tricky, actually. I think I can get it this time. Yeah, yeah time just right. I gotta get closer. Close enough. Come on. Come on. Come on. Do it. There we go. Get his fluffy butt. Oh, we got him. What to do? And now, yeah, he's coming after me specifically. So it will be easier to get him. Not as so easy to knock him out.
shit. Yeah, this is super hard. Oh my god, oh my god, what am I supposed to do? Oh, got him. I got him. And now he's very angry. I do not have a lot of health. Okay. Third time. Third time is going to do it. We got this. We got this. Okay. Okay. Serious mode. Minimal talking. I'm just going to focus, you know? Going to get this. Serious Iggy is activated. Got him. Okay. Last phase. Last phase is where it gets really hard. Unless I'm, like, doing something wrong, you know? Get him. Get, get him. Oh. oh my god, he's he fucking shuts down so quick. Oh my god, what am I supposed to do to stop him? Oh. Again, again. Got him. Got him. Come on, get him. No! Oh, I fucking had him. Ass. <sighs> yes, 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 yes. Come on, come on, come on. No! Ah, damn it! Okay, I gotta dodge him, and then hit it. Fuck! Fourth time. Fourth time is okay. I got plenty of lives I can finish this. <clears throat> this is a real hard boss, man. <laughs> okay, okay, first one's silly, second one's not that hard, third one is where it gets friggin' go time. Nope. Crap, I already gotta use a coin? There we go, there we go. <sighs> The white eyebrows really kind of freak me out. Yep. There we go. Okay, that's two. I just gotta get him the third time. This is when it gets real friggin' hard. But I think I understand his pattern a little bit better now. I was I was jumping a little jumping the gun a little too quick last time. And then he does it again. 
And then we gotta go. Oh, Got him. Got him. Okay. The pattern was weird. Because you have to wait for him to come up a little bit. Then you bop him. Then you do it. Like, you have to wait for the correct moment. And I was just kind of hitting it constantly. And it was not working the way I expected it to. Okay. That should do it. For tonight, though, thanks for watching, everybody, whether it's in the past, present, or future. If you missed the beginning of this stream and like to watch it or any of my past streams, you can check the past broadcast tab up above on the browser version. You can also check out Iggy Kid Twitch Archive on YouTube, which is my YouTube archive channel. It has all of my streams. That's linked down below on the browser version, as well as Iggy and the Ape, my personal YouTube. I just posted uh, Zelda Sequelitis Response number 4 million, which is... I worked for quite a long time on and I worked really hard on, so I'd appreciate it if you all check it out. You know, give it a shot. I also post other things on YouTube. I'm planning on posting more in the coming weeks. Hopefully. I'm, work I'm working on a lot of stuff. Well, when it comes out, uh, I don't know, but I'm working on it. It'll come out eventually here. Hopefully not too long. So please subscribe there. I promise I'll have some content for you soon. If you want to catch any future streams, you can check the schedule down below, which says what game on what day. Or if you click the stream icon and go to the schedule tab, you can see what hour and what game on what day. That's all subject to change, though, so if you want to make sure you don't miss anything, follow me on Twitter at IggyDKid and turn on the notifications. That way you'll get notified whenever I tweet that I'm about to go live, because I always tweet it out. Um, but even better than that would be if you followed by hitting the heart up above, and that greatly helps. Is it up above or is it below it, you click the heart you follow it's free for you all you need is an account and the account itself is free um and it helps out the channel a great deal so i'd really appreciate it. you can set up notifications uh to get either through the app or through email or whatever you can get notifications when i go live so that's the best way to make sure you don't miss any streams so i want to thank you once again for inviting me into your home your computer your laptop your tablet your phone your game console however it is you watch tonight i hope i brought some entertainment and levity into your life i do my best um i hope you'll join us tomorrow at eight for i believe the finale of mario galaxy i should be able to beat it tomorrow i think i'm, I'm gonna go until i beat it so we'll see how that works out in any case no one else has ever told you this before i will tell you this right now you're a good kid. Thanks for watching, everybody. Wait, let me say that again. You're a good kid. Yes, I mumbled it first. I don't want to mumble that. That's a very heartfelt thing. All right. And that's it, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. Good night. Join me tomorrow at 8 for the finale. Goodbye. Good night. Have a great weekend. Goodbye.